This is a very last minute reaction video I decided to do. I'm kind of doing this out of order. I've got a video that's going up this Friday. I'll be away at Dragon Con around that time. It's a reaction video to Jeff Hayes doing a cold read session for a portion of book five of Dungeon Crawler Carl. And book six is getting ready to come out on Friday. You guys, it, it has exploded on Amazon slash Audible. At one point, it got up into the like number four spot in all of Audible. And it's number one in several different subcategories, or at least two or three. So there's a lot of expectation about this book. It has built this huge following, which is really awesome. And as I mentioned in the video that I'm putting up on Friday, to coincide with the release of book six, Jeff Hayes narrates this book as, well, in the voice of Patrick Warburton. He gives the character that voice and the character, it's first person narration. So he also narrates in that voice. And so at some point we had the idea that, you know, it'd be really cool if we could get Patrick Warburton on board. And we did. I mentioned this in the Friday video. So by the time you see that, it'll be old news. About a month and a half ago, Jeff and Emily went out to California to do a directed session with Patrick Warburton. They said he was absolutely amazing. Just a very gracious, humble, super kind person. And there was quite a bit of video that was taken. It's been condensed down into a promo for uh, the pre-order for Dungeon Crawler Carl 6. Eye of the Bedlam Bride is the name of it. And I decided I wanted to do a reaction to it. Now, I thought maybe we were going to have a, a longer promo type of video. I don't know if anything like that's going to come up. If it does, uh, maybe I'll react to that. I've only seen little clippets of the videos that were taken when Patrick was doing the studio session. So maybe some of this I've seen before, but I stopped watching it early on because I didn't want to see everything. I wanted to share my initial reaction with you guys. So that's a long ass intro to a very short video that I'm going to be reacting to, but I'm, I'm hoping to get it up before I leave. I have to leave at the ass crack of dawn tomorrow, you guys. So I don't have a lot of time today, but let's just try to get this one out and see what it looks like. Patrick Warburton doing the voice of Carl's dad, the main character's dad. So appropriate. <laughs> I haven't seen that. God damn. Worthless pussies. <laughs> These crabs have the souls of their ancestors in their sperm, and they need to fill this floor of the dungeon with more souls. That's not what your mom said. I'm your daddy now. <laughs> you gotta have a talk about how you treat your family. We're gonna have some fist therapy. <laughs> that's amazing. The Sound Booth Theater production. Oh, that's so great. Are you just gonna sit there and stare at me? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so great. I was wanting to see if, they, okay, that's, I guess that's it. Um, yeah, that's definitely it. Uh, that was amazing. Patrick, you know, I'm not into lit RPG, which is what this book is, game lit slash lit RPG. But I do know that Matt is a really good writer. He's also done another series that we worked on called Kaiju Battlefield Surgeon. And I haven't listened to this book series yet. But there's just so much hype about it, and it's it's gotten so many great reviews. I was like, you know, maybe it's about time for me to start listening to this book. <laughs> it's only book six coming out, and I haven't listened to them yet. But it, I was just thinking while I was watching this clip of Jeff directing Patrick when he was talking about the crabs and the and the like the DNA of their ancestors or something, and he was saying how that as he directed Patrick, you know, he was giving him these pointers and it's a really crazy concept, the whole idea of this story. But Patrick just like, he took it and he did exactly what was needed for it. He was such a pro and this is a super cool experience 
and time for Sound Booth Theater. I'm so proud of the work that Jeff has done and leading up to just getting more and more notice and recognition. And I'm hoping that Dragon Con will be a pretty exciting time. It's going to be very busy. Jeff's doing another reading of Dungeon Crawler Carl like he did last year that I showed in my vlog video. I'll try to remember to put links to the vlog video somewhere in the description or whatever. I'll also put links to the pre-order for Dungeon Crawler Carl 6. And we also have episode one of book one, the audio immersion tunnel version going up on our website on Friday as well to coincide with the release of book six. That episode one is going to be free. And so if you guys are interested to check it out, go ahead and grab it and let me know what you think if you're into this kind of thing. But uh, yeah, this is really cool. And I'm glad that these were portions of the videos taken that I had not yet seen. So this was completely new to me. Okay, I don't think I have anything else to add. Some of the stuff that I'm talking about here is going to be a bit redundant when the Friday video comes up. That Friday video, I thought about putting it up today, but I decided, no, I'll just keep it Friday and I'll put this one up today, Wednesday. The Friday video was filmed back in February before we knew we had secured Patrick. Jeff and Emily went up to do the recording session with him in mid-July, so a lot of time had passed from that first video to what happened in mid-July. Yep, I'm rambling. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. I have got a crap ton of stuff to do today before we have to leave. So I will see you guys later. Adios.